the services we go to. And if we don't go to God believing that you're going to hear me and that I'm going to be a changed person, there's no sense in me coming, but I'm here because I believe you're going to hear me and I'm going to be changed. I don't know about you. I'm going to be changed. If God could forgive this man, and what happened to Manasseh, what did he do? And brought him again to Jerusalem. And the Lord heard his supplication. Brought him back to Ju Judah, yes. To Jerusalem, yes. Into his kingdom. Into his kingdom. Then Manasseh knew. Then Manasseh knew. That the Lord, he was God. That God is God, yes. Now after this. Yes. He built a wall without the city of David. Manasseh. Brought that whole church back to God. When you come through your supplication, because here's that order of that intercession and we're about to close. When you come through your supplication, and when you're found and you've made your confessions, and you've stayed and treated by God until you got an answer, then the Lord starts telling you, now this is how we got to make these crooked paths straight. This is where you got to start turning some things around. Then brother, if I've gone through that, then I'm able to take you through it when it's time for you to turn at God's reproof. Because we do a lot of repentance. But if I didn't learn the supplication of he answered me, and when he answered me, he told me how to come out of this. He told me how to fix it. So my repentance is all right. But now I need an intercessor to teach me how to turn. I got to turn from this that I never be found in that evil again. That supplication is saying, I've learned how to, he said, I had to, I, I, I took the church all the way into idolatry. So I took the church all the way into witchcraft. He said, and God had to afflict me to make me get myself right and bring it back to God. He said, then I had to bring that church all the way back to the will of God. You know when a person been in a real seat because they change. They go and they make the necessary changes. Because what am I doing? I'm building the wall that the devil never get in this area in my life again. I'm building that wall. Supplications, making our earnest requests before the Lord. It's making our earnest prayer before the Lord. And I'm learning how to do that because my next level is now i got to come through my purification with God. Now, that purification is where he's trying me because now he's working out the impurities of where it is that I have to go in him. Everybody stand to your feet.